My books are funny but true. Hi guys, I'm Kevin McCluskey. I've been an author and illustrator for over 50 years. And what I really love to do is visit schools and libraries. I've done that in Pennsylvania, where I live, and Virginia, and Maryland, and Minneapolis, Minnesota, and I've been to Denver, Colorado, and San Francisco, but I can't visit schools and libraries right now, so I'd like to invite you to visit my studio. And so my studio is in my garage. I've got lots of books, mostly comic books, and that's my wife, Mama Pat. There's my house space. Here's my light table, my flat files where I keep my artwork flat, my computer, which I do use, all my paints and supplies, brushes and pens, and here's my cranky. I want to tell you about that in a minute. This is my light table, and it's really just a table with a light in it. And for me, it's the most exciting thing. I'm going to show you how it works. I'm working on this project about butterflies. And butterflies, both their wings are the same, symmetrical. They're sort of like mirror images. So what I do, I draw one wing that I like, and then I put it down on the light table, and then I hold another piece of paper on top of it, and I can do the exact same drawing in a mirror image. Now I've got the left wing of the butterfly, and the right wing of the butterfly, and it's that simple. What I'm really excited about is my new technology. I love technology even if it comes from another century. I got my friend Emile's to make me this box, and it's called a Cranky Box. A Cranky is a device, before they had computers, before they had televisions, kids would go and sit down and watch a Cranky show. My poop is good for the soil, says the little worm. Ew, says the girl, but it's true. Worm poop is filled with nitrogen and it's good for the soil. Something's fishy. This is called a flat file. It's where you keep everything. And at first I thought, okay, his eyes kind of shaped like a fish and this is what the cover was gonna be like. And it's very simple. I draw on cardboard and it didn't work out that way. I went and I got, did a much better face. This is my pigeon hat I sometimes wear at schools. <laughs> and on the back, the kids get excited when they see this, but it's really toothpaste. Let's go.